morning sun shining on me from a crack in the curtains wakes me from my dream. And I slowly sit up. <laughs> that is not I, a crack. I, I, That's just open. <laughs> what a crazy dream. I... <laughs> I sure am glad that that Subire, gr Subire girl is not real. The end. Ow, ow. I barely moved, but my joints and muscles scream out in pain. What the hell? Why am I sleeping on the floor? Why am I bleeding? Yep. Yeah. Despite laying down a long cushion to sleep on, it was only it was the only thing separating me from the floor. No wonder I'm in pain. Just when the fuzz of sleep clears from my bed, from my brain, I notice the lump on my bed. Oh, yeah, now I remember. Last night I'd met Sumire, a girl claiming to be a ninja, and after a slight commotion, ended up offering her accommodation at my place. Okay, we, yeah, we just fucking played it. I feel my face relax, listening to her adorable little snore as she sleeps on comfortably. <laughs> <laughs> she sure is happy to be sleeping. Seeing a cute girl like this sleeping helplessly in my bed was like a dream come true. Just hold on a minute. If she really is a self-proclaimed ninja, should she really Wait be just a second! <laughs> in a sleep so deep she can't even sense another person in the room? Lost in thought, I head to the bathroom. After washing That's my face, the I... hard to believe part. <laughs> After, after washing my face, I go to the kitchen, put on my apron, and roll up my sleeves. I'll go ahead and make breakfast before Sumire wakes up. It's just completely nude except an apron, it sounds like. <laughs> Usually I have toast and milk, but remembering what Sumire said yesterday, I can imagine she must prefer rice. Peeping into my rice cooker, I see the white rice I set up yesterday gleaming back at me, now cooked. I don't mean to brag, but I make perfect rice. All right, I have, dude. <laughs> I have rice, so next. Guess I'll make miso soup. Wasn't there a thing about miso soup in, uh, like Zero Escape or Danganronpa? Was there? I, I seem to remember. Honestly, I have no idea. There was like a Monokuma theater where he's like, I make the best miso soup. Like, <laughs> something like that. It's not like I'm going People to always scratch. bragging about their miso soup in visual novels. Yeah. What? Feast. An even more enthusiastic reaction than I'd expected. Well, this was a high-class luxury for me, but probably a normal breakfast for, for anyone else. Sucks it into her mouth like a vacuum. <laughs> like Kirby? Yeah. She eats all the food. Come on, it's not that amazing. That's not true. Anything you prepare is a feast, master. Let's eat. Eyes lit up. Sumire sits across from me and brings her hands together in thanks. Thank you for the feast. Wait, damn it, it's already happening. She's converting me. <laughs> master, may I have seconds? Uh, I don't know. Are you a clock? Oh, I get it. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. She clenches her fists in victory, but then freezes. What's wrong? Where's the rice pot? Rice pot? If you mean the rice cooker, it's over there. Rice cooker? What? Why is she throwing the words rice cooker back at me as a question? So, this is a rice cooker. <laughs> Just press this button and the top opens. Whoa! <laughs> and this is where I put my face in! <laughs> no, 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 no! <laughs> she looks so excited that I'm sure the person who invented the rice cooker would have been thrilled. I feel happy too, for some reason. Ooh, I can't believe this exists! Science sure is amazing, isn't it? This is supposed to be, like, adorable, but I feel nothing. <laughs> you... Can't be that lost in the past. Hey, are you really a ninja? Huh? Are you still doubting me, master? What did you expect? You actually think I believe there are ninjas around in this day and age? I thought he was like, I didn't, I didn't know ninjas existed. 
Does he does he just mean in the present day? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I don't know what to say. I truly am a ninja. I don't know how I can convince you. I don't know. Do a ninja thing. She said while we're while going to grab more rice from the rice cooker. She did a cool flip. Sumire sits back down, then slowly takes out her throwing star and knife. Oh, okay, she has those now. She places them on the table where I can see. In the blink of an eye, I can throw this throwing star directly at your throat. Ready? Wait, what? <laughs> One, two. <laughs> like, like it, it's just a blur. Like, he doesn't even see her move. <laughs> and suddenly, he just has a throwing star in his neck. How about these? No normal person would carry around a throwing star and knife. Apparently, real cosplay maniacs get pretty thorough. I won't believe you just because you showed me some props. Give me your ninja's license. <laughs> of course, I'd quickly realized that her weapons weren't just wood or plastic. But that doesn't mean I'm going to acknowledge that Sumire is a real ninja. Ninja are a thing of the past anyway, like from the Warring States period or whatever. There are still ninja nowadays, you know. Not only my village, but others as well. Have you ever seen Naruto? <laughs> the Hidden Leaf Village. I suddenly realized that Sumire is refilling her rice bowl. Again. Wait a sec, how many times has she gotten seconds? All right, then just for you, I'll demonstrate the arts of ninjutsu. Then you'll have to believe me. <laughs> he, she just immediately gets up and starts pummeling him. I gets call up my stand. <laughs> summons her stand. All right, it's time to go outside. Finally. I have to clean up first, though. <laughs> the, the room is, like, <laughs> covered in rice. Rice <laughs> everywhere. I'm not too much of a neat Nick, but I don't like leaving stuff scattered around like a slob. Wait a minute, where did this rice mountain come from? <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, of course. I'll help you wash the dishes. Nice. With my tongue. Uh, no, uh, Use, a, use the sponge. A sponge? La, 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 la. <laughs> What's a sponge? <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we go. My kitchen is too narrow oh, for two people to fit. Just let me do it and you can relax here. I know Sumire, Sumire took a few helpings of rice, but how much did she eat exactly? I better check the rice cooker. We've still got lunch and dinner after all. It's just fucking empty. No way. When I, yeah. When I open the rice cooker, I see there is not a single grain of, li of rice left inside. We shall starve. <laughs> How many cups of rice did I make again? I'm pretty sure it was three. For me, more than enough rice for a whole day. And I, I cannot imagine bowl. just eating rice for breakfast, lunch, and dinner every day. <laughs> yeah. And miso soup. I already eat rice for like one meal a day, but every meal, yeah, I, I don't know if I can do that. What the fuck did you do? Why did you eat all the rice? We're gonna go hungry. Are you kidding me? <laughs> How much can one person eat? I glance at Sumire's swim, sl slim waist, and it's the wrong pronunciation. It's the wrong spelling of waist. <laughs> <laughs> Her slim waist covered. <laughs> Never mind. After picking out like that, there was Gross. the slightest hint of a tummy bulge. No way she's digested it already. I mean, dude, when you're an athlete, you burn calories faster, so you eat more. I finish washing the dishes, and then we head to the park. To the children's playground we go. At this time of day, it's almost empty, not to mention pretty spacious. I can't imagine what kind of ninja skills Sumire is planning to show me, but it shouldn't be a problem here. She just, like, goes down the slide. Whee! <laughs> That was my ninja skill. <laughs> Alright, you've convinced me. <laughs> well, what do you have to show me? Hmm, what do you want to see? I have a lot of skills. 
to so, pay the bills. Why don't you do some tricks with the throwing star you showed me? That screams ninja. <laughs> oh, tricks? You mean like killing people? <laughs> I sure. can do that. Who do you want me to kill? <laughs> I'm your personal Looks assassin. Looks like you're the only one around. <laughs> Wait, no, the old guy's still tied up on the bench. Hiya! <laughs> <laughs> Miss Peggy. <laughs> the, <laughs> the old guy just starts bleeding profusely. As you wish. Princess Bride, good movie. Watch carefully. Uh, it is a good movie. Subire takes a few steps away from me. Then she changes direction and with a running start lets fly her throwing star. It flies by too fast to see. It sticks fast in it sticks fast in tree trunk. <laughs> that reminds me, I read something online that said if you were to convert a throwing star to a baseball, it would be like a blazing fastball flying by at 180 kilometers per hour. What are you talking about? What? I don't I don't know what that's supposed to mean. See, I hit the tree, didn't I? Now do you believe me? Oh please, I could hit that tree. Let me try. And then he just spends like the next six hours <laughs> just failing to hit the tree. No wait, I got it this time. Wait, <laughs> wait, hold on. <laughs> All it would take is a little practice to do that. How about something only a ninja could do? I love the idea that this guy's name is Ninja Gus and he doesn't believe that ninjas exist. <laughs> 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 is this whole game just gonna be this? I, I thought it was supposed to be romantic. No idea. Maybe it gets to a... What? Yeah. But Master, you were the one who wanted to... S I mean, there was like a panty shot and everything. The one who wanted me to see use my throwing... To see me use my throwing star. I think they're just laying groundwork right now. Hmm. She's right. I just don't care about any of the groundwork. <laughs> That's the problem. Yeah. I'm not quite innocent enough to acknowledge she's a ninja after seeing a little throwing star trick. <laughs> I'm, I'm guilty. Do. I'm a naughty little boy. <laughs> oh, I just have to show you my special move. What? What are you planning? <laughs> Don't concern yourself about that. Oh, it, but it's a little risky there. You wouldn't want to get burned? Burned? Hadouken! Ready? Ninja art! Fire Jutsu! Whoa! <laughs> oh god! Oh, she can breathe fire! Just okay, what Sumire yells cool. out. A red blur I'm on fills board with my vision. Now. Yeah, yeah, you know what? I like me a girl who can breathe fire. <laughs> that red blur I like is a, a girl with a fiery personality, if you know what I'm saying. If she can eat three cups of rice and breathe fire, yeah. Oh, she can cook the rice using her breath. <laughs> yeah. Subire just created fire from air. Ugh! What the hell are you doing? <laughs> it's like Charlie Brown. Ugh! <laughs> Tries to kick the football. Sumire just pulls it away. What am I? Fire Jutsu, of course. Would Water Jutsu have been better? She could do Water Jutsu too? That's impressive, but this isn't the time for that. I may not like it, but I was my village's most promising ninja apprentice. There's not one ninja skill I haven't mastered. Cool, can you teleport? No. No. <laughs> Sumire sticks out her chin with a smug look. It seems she's trying to convince me what a capable ninja she is. But. But. Who cares about that? Look, the grass is on fire. Uh, what? Oh no, master, what should we do? Uh, we what should I here. do? The penis music is back! <laughs> oh no! Just ahead of the blazer fire. My following. least favorite genre! <laughs> that Tsumire let loose is a pile of grass and sticks that the park manager had pruned off. <laughs> the pile is already smoking. If we leave it like this, it could turn into a bonfire. <laughs> Wacky, oh. we just started a fire music. Yeah. 
water. Get the firefighters. Just use the water jutsu you just said you had. Yeah, yeah. Jeez. Ah, uh, Master, I'm so sorry. Master, I'm so sorry. Don't just stand there apologizing. We have to put this fire out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm yeah. Sorry. Oh, what is this? <laughs> so so many, many, oh, wait. Water no, jutsu, that's... Right? Uh, yeah. J just wait a minute. Is it gonna be the same pose, but now it's water instead of fire? <laughs> well, the water has to come out of her butt. It's what? It's different. Oh, because the, it's opposite. Yeah. Oh, I see. The blazing flame is swallowed in an instant by the sudden rush of water. I feel like I'm watching the CG special effects in a Hollywood movie. Mm. It's out. I checked to make sure nothing else is on fire, but apparently it's been put out completely. At least we won't get in trouble for Larson now. It's arson! I, I think he means arson! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Sumire, time to run away! And it's larceny, not Larson. Yeah. <laughs> he didn't do- he, 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 he couldn't even get the wrong word right. Run away? Why? Fire didn't get out of hand, but we'll start attracting a crowd with this commotion. How am I supposed to explain that it was only a ninja showing off her skills to everyone? I swallow my urge to scream out in panic. Ah! First, we have to get out of here. Come on, let's go up the rock wall and through the tunnel. They won't find us in there. <laughs> <laughs> Sumire is still oblivious to the situation, but I grab her hand and we leap out of the park. Sumire is unquestionably the real thing. Exactly like a ninja one might see in an anime or manga. Is this actually possible in modern society? But what I saw was clearly very real. There's no room for doubt. I mean, she practically burned down the park. This she was a menace to society and I couldn't <laughs> let her roam free. <laughs> like they're, they're, they're like, they go back home and they turn on the TV and it's just J. Jonah Jameson and he's like, this ninja girl is a menace! <laughs> I want pictures of Sumi Ray! <laughs> oh, uh, Lost in thought, I didn't see the woman who just walked around the corner. I swerve out of her way in a panic, just managing to avoid a collision, and then regain my balance. What's happening? Franklin! It what is, was that's not gonna make sense. Dog. A pretty big one at that. Yeah, I, I know. <laughs> it warns me away with a low growl. I suppose it thinks I'm a thug out to hurt its owner. <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry about that. I do not want to be bitten by that dog. No, thank you. We flee the scene, leaving apologies in our wake. Okay. Now, for the same fucking background... <sighs> so what, what was... We should be fine. What did we learn from that scene? What was the character development there? Uh, of them running into a woman and almost getting bit by a dog. I, uh, I don't know. Wait a sec, what? I think it was just an excuse for them to end that scene and then, like, start <laughs> another scene on the same background? Sure. I'm pretty sure this is the same background anyway. If it isn't, it looks very similar. Yeah. Wait a sec, why have I been on the run at full speed until now again? I have a ninja bodyguard I now. I could just have her protect me from the dog. Plaz, I'm pretty sure this is the same alleyway as the night one as well. It's just it the is. lighting is different. Yes. Sumire, are you okay? That was a lot of running. Hang on, she's a ninja. Yesterday she nonchalantly told me that she ran across the rooftops, so she's undeniably in better physical condition than me. I bet you've been running like this since you were a kid, huh? Like ninja training and stuff. No response from Sumire. Oh no, she's, she's dead. Gone. Yes, I finally got rid of her. Woo! Yeah, baby, it's what I was waiting for. <laughs> That's what I was waiting for. Sorry. <laughs> Sumire? I glanced behind me, but no one was there. Sumire! That's weird. Where'd she go? Crap, now I've got to go look for her. Or I could just go home and save a lot of money on rice for the foreseeable future. Hmm. Even That's if a I better just idea. leave her now, I have feeling there will be trouble. I have feeling 
there will still be trouble. Is this another dialogue option? No, no never clue. mind. Catching my We've breath. only had one so far. Yeah. I head back the way I come, determined to find Sumire. Is she with the dog? Maybe we should have just ignored her and then left left it at that. <laughs> I wonder what happens if you do that, actually. You lose immediately? I don't know. <laughs> Either that or you Ma like, maybe it's no, just, I can't do just that. Just leads to the I same thing. Her, yeah. Yeah. On the way back, I can't help feeling like I heard a scream from far away. Uh... What? Is this a new character? Could that possibly be Sumire's voice? I walk in the direction of the voice, and the words become clearer and clearer as I draw near. I finally arrive at the source. What? Oh, she's scared of the dog. Oh. Why? She's a ninja. <laughs> like, they still had dogs, right? We don't have dogs in my village. We only had cats. Oh, no. Master, help me! Help me, the penis music is back. <laughs> no! I see Sumire hanging onto a telephone pole up ahead. Here we go again. <laughs> what in the world are you doing up there? A dog! There's a dog down there! A dog? The dog like, breathes <laughs> In case you couldn't see it. <laughs> the menacing dog. <laughs> Just below the telephone pole that Subire was clinging to is that huge dog belonging to the woman I almost bumped into. Okay, so that's why it was important. <laughs> the guys playing the game that we mentioned earlier are like, yeah. No, go back to the butt! <laughs> Please! <laughs> Please! Damn it, it's buffering again! <laughs> Master, help me, please. I'm afraid of dog. Why is my internet so bad? <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Here's another, another dog. No, encourage option. her. Oh, don't I did help a, her. I did a quick save, I guess. I don't know how okay, I did nice. that. I feel like she could do it on her own. Yeah, I, I feel yeah. like encouraging is fine. I know she said she hates dogs, but... The dog giving Sumirai trouble looks like a breed called a shepherd. The owner is nowhere to be seen. Why? The owner is clinging to a like the owner is clinging higher up on the telephone pole and is like, "Help! I'm scared of ninjas." <laughs> 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 I guess the owner accidentally lost hold of the leash, probably because I almost bumped into her. What a mess I've caused! I'm sure the poor owner is running around looking for her dog in a panic, just like I was running around looking for my ninja in a panic. Yes, master. <laughs> Are you standing there with your arms crossed, looking so calm? What? Oh, sorry. Subire is clinging to the pole, doing her best to avoid being bitten by the shepherd. I guess I've just been absent-mindedly staring at them while trying to make a rational decision. I've heard that you become calmer when you see other people in distress. In, in distress, it might just be true. I love that this guy is just like standing there, like thinking and narrating this whole time while she's in danger. He's, like, not fucking doing anything. While my friend was being teared to bits by a <laughs> rabid dog, I stood and wondered what I should do next. Yeah. Sumire, can't you use your ninja skills for this? No, no, for some reason. Why not? You call yourself a ninja, I think. Exasperated. Ugh. Okay, I know this isn't the time to get annoyed. <laughs> Master, help me! I'd like to help, but that dog's scary. <laughs> that's that's a really scary dog. <laughs> I mean, have you seen that dog? It's basically Cerberus. <laughs> Going up to a huge dog like that would be completely crazy. I mean, it looks pretty excited. It doesn't look huge, does it? It, I, yeah. I bet he likes Sumire. From what I can see, he's not trying to attack you. It'll be fine. How do you know that without asking? You want me to ask the dog? Like, that'll make a difference. Dogs don't speak human. Hello there. <laughs> I'm sorry for the misunderstanding. <laughs> Apologies, miss. Master, 
How can you be so cold? What am I supposed to do? With a dog that size, I could get bitten and seriously injured if I try to get between you two. My master is so heartless! Don't worry, I'll be cheering for you from down here. He'll take off eventually. <laughs> <laughs> You've got it! <laughs> He's just sitting there eating popcorn. You can do it! <laughs> My arms might give out of me before that happens, you know? It's a reasonable assessment. She may be a ninja, but she can only cling onto the pole for so long with those thin arms of hers. Wait, if she uses that fire jutsu from before, she should be able to escape easily. Do are you saying that she should cook the dog? Yes. I must be losing my ability to think logically. I'd better just stick to encouraging her. Why do I get the feeling that this is going to make her hate us? You can do yeah. it, Sumire. Just hang on a little longer. We'll be fine. Oh, <laughs> it was in parentheses and I thought, is this the dog talking? <laughs> okay. <laughs> She's definitely not moving. <laughs> oh well. Time to go in for the other. kill. That's gotta be the fastest plan of action. Okay. Just wait there, I'll go look for the owner. No, don't leave me! What does she want from me? Alright, bye. Oh my god, did picking that one dialogue option ju just lead to, like, an extra two paragraphs or something? <laughs> Excuse me? Oh, you're... When I turn around towards the voice calling me, I see the woman I had always bumped into back at the corner. She's come running and is out of breath. I'm so sorry for all the trouble my boy has caused. The woman quickly grabs the leash and pulls the shepherd away from the pole. He resists at first, but on seeing that the one tugging is his owner, he happily wags his tail and comes obediently. It's alright. I mean, nobody was hurt. I'm the one who should apologize for almost crashing into you. I'm sorry, he just can't resist the ladies. He's always aggressive with men, though. I feel incredibly relieved that I didn't try to wrestle with the leash. Forcing a smile onto my face, the ga my gaze slides from the woman to the shepherd. He directs a pleading bark at me. I get how you feel, buddy. But I can't let you terrify Sumire any longer. <laughs> I too want to bite her sometimes. <laughs> we exchange a few words with the woman, and then part ways after she tells me she has urgent business to attend to. After checking that the dog is out of sight, she I call Sumire again. <laughs> she asks to live with me. Oh boy. The dog is also a ninja. <laughs> ninja dog. <laughs> <laughs> Before, um, can you imagine if the actual plot of this game was like slowly assembling a harem of ninjas oh in his house? <laughs> That'd be cool. They're all eating like a. They're all of eating rice, rice every day. <laughs> you suck. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> As if my words were a signal, Sumire just slides down the pole without the slightest hesitation. Just when I think she's about to stumble, her legs fold and she sits on the spot. Hey. Her, her legs fold into a perfect origami crane, just <laughs> like a real ninja. <laughs> <laughs> I feel so relieved that my legs lost all their strength. What? Sumire manages a smile while she scratches her nose in embarrassment. Are you going to be sitting there for a while? I don't think I can stand. Master, why don't you go on home instead of me? We're gonna what piggyback if, ride her. Another we? dog. Yeah, we did just gonna. Yep. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you, you, you absolutely called it. I couldn't do that. Come on, I'll give you a piggyback ride. What? Oh, you don't have to. Why not? You don't want a piggyback from the likes of me? Someone like me? I didn't say that! It's just, I would be a disgrace as a ninja if I let you see me any more pitiful than this. Or if you saw my panties. Oh. Whoa, wow. Is it a little late for that? I did find you collapsed on the street from hunger, you know. Oops! Wrong button! Enough already, just get on. Uh, okay. Oh! <laughs> oh, there's no art for it. Well, I would assume not, because they're not going to go through the trouble of drawing Ninja Gus. 
a new <laughs> character design, yeah. Yeah. Sumire replies abashedly and then slowly climbs onto my back. We should just Which... add our own <laughs> art for this game. <laughs> Of all the stuff they don't show. Oh, like that'd in be awesome. MS Paint, we draw fire. <laughs> Being scared of dogs like that is really pathetic. I can tell by her voice that she's pretty bummed out about all this. That's not true. Everyone has a few fears they have to deal with. Other people in my village train hard to become skilled, skilled ninja. Most of them are hardly afraid of anything. There's even training for a ninja's canine companion, the Ninken. So there are ninja dogs! Yes! Yo! Where can I get one? Oh yeah, there are even techniques where ninjas <laughs> use animal companions, aren't there? I remember a scene from a manga when a character summons an animal to his side. <laughs> Excuse me, I'd like to turn in my ninja girl for a ninja dog. <laughs> are you sure? What? <laughs> Oh, absolutely. Alright, you have to do the paperwork, though. No problem. And sign here. Sumire, are you skilled in summoning? Well, I can kind of do it. Technically. That's not very clear. So you're not good at it? I didn't say that! I told you, I'm the most promising apprentice in all the village. Why can't you give me a straight answer? Okay, I suck. Well, <laughs> you, you see... Don't laugh, okay? Subire seems to make a decision about something, and starts to fidget on my back. What is she planning? Huh? I hear a light pop. However, there's no sign of a dog or a cat appearing anywhere. Huh? Was that no-go? No, I made a successful summoning. Look, over there. <laughs> he looks- he looks up <laughs> where she's pointing, and there's just like a gigantic kaiju like looming over <laughs> them. <laughs> oh. Oh, it's a mouse. Looking in the direction that Sumire indicates, I see a small creature in the middle of the street. That's some s sort of creature. <laughs> Speaking of summoning, I expected something along the lines of a dog or a crow. I hadn't anticipated this. The little mouse scurries towards Smire and stands directly in front of her, as if awaiting her command. Ninja mouse! <laughs> Definitely unanticipated, but I can't deny that it's a fine example of an animal summoning. Just wondering, but why are you so bad with dogs? Considering what just happened, her phobia is no joke. Something happened while I was training a ninkan. <laughs> that face. Something. I was careless and stepped on his tail. After he ho that, he howled at me and bit me right in the behind. It was terrible. That's all? I really thought he was gonna eat me, eat me alive? Ah, I see. A childhood trauma, I suppose. When I was in kindergarten, I'd been bitten by a snake, and since then I've never liked reptiles. I did not tell her that, though. Still, I would <laughs> What if she had summoned a snake and he was just like, ah! I know I could do it if I tried, but I'm so terrified of dogs. Maybe you could try summoning a Nintendo instead. <laughs> Ninken dogs? <laughs> yeah. I think I feel it. Same <laughs> shot of the sky. Tightening of Sumire's arms around my neck. Ah! I start to have trouble breathing. Lose consciousness. Lose consciousness. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, the end. <laughs> Of this closest one of waving